Well, Kara, one of the main storylines in Lincoln this year has been the sister act of Tatum and Taylor Edwards. And as Kara explains a bit further, it's a connection that goes much further than the 43 feet separating pitcher and catcher. The battery is a term for pitcher catcher. There's a positive and negative. Hopefully there's no negative in there, but the negative is constructive criticism. That kind of leads to positives. The negative pushes the positive. Rhythm, ebb and flow. The harmony of a pitcher and catcher in sync can be a beautiful spectacle. This season, fans have been treated to this symphony when Cornhusker junior pitcher Tatum Edwards takes the rubber with junior catcher and twin sister, Taylor Edwards. They communicate probably better than anybody even knows because they communicate without saying anything. You know, they talk about it all the time, just that look. They know exactly what each other's thinking. And I'm like, okay, yeah, okay, I'll go with you there. When it happens, people will know, like, that'll yeah. be like the first thing we say, like, oh my gosh, like. Yeah. We had this weird moment today. It was the same yeah. exact time. It's but like, I mean, that happens on the softball field too. Yeah. Like with with the pitch calling, like she'll mm -hmm. put a pitch down or she'll say something and I'll be like, I knew that you were gonna say that or do that. During their first two seasons, the twins' connection earned the trust of the Nebraska coaching staff as Taylor was allowed to call Tatum's pitches. I call pitches for her all throughout high school and then in travel ball too sometimes. And it's just, I know, I just know her. This fall, Coach Rhonda Ravel threw the sisters a changeup, becoming part of the pitch calling. What I did is over time, I tried to include myself as part of their comfort zone. If I can just really watch Taylor call her games, then I'm gonna take all that in and I'm gonna learn from that. I also knew that I had things to offer uh, in the repertoire and the strategy and the looking at game film and being able to pick apart hitters. She wanted to get a feel of our connection and see how she could maneuver her way into it instead of just taking over it. That's just been a big thing too, like allowing somebody inside of our little circle that we have, but it's been great. I've really appreciated everything that Coach Vell has done. Last fall when we were playing Colorado State and Tatum threw a really beautiful game and that night I had texted her and I said, it was really fun to call your game today. And she said, yeah, Coach, I had a lot of fun. And she wasn't quite picking up what I was putting down. I said, you know, this was our first game together that it was 100% strategic. She put so much time and effort into really getting to know our opponents. And I mean, we obviously wouldn't be where we are now if she didn't do that. The Edwards sisters were reunited with a familiar face this season when freshman pitcher Emily Lockman joined the Nebraska pitching staff who competed for the same summer team in California. It's a different, different story when two competitive pitchers enter the same bullpen, ultimately wanting the same thing with the team success, understanding that pitching is a critical element, and yet sharing that. And they have done it as well as any two we've ever had. I'm an information person, and so I want to know every detail about everything. So if I don't know something, like if I'm unsure about a batter or a pitch, I have to ask the question. Coach Ravel and Coach Sipple really helped me with that. I haven't met too many freshmen that are already taking the bull by the horns and saying, I want to be the best I can be. And they really kind of have a vision of what that looks like, and the vision is correct. Together, the California combination has formed one of the most talented batteries in the nation. Tatum and Emily really see themselves as, as a, a, a great pitcher together. If you think of it in directions, Tatum is more of a north-south pitcher, you know, drop ball, everybody knows she has drop ball, and she's developing her rise ball. Emily's more of an east-west, you know, she's got a curve and a screw, and she, but yet she throws it at three different levels. Yeah, 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 yeah let's do that. Yeah, yeah. We equal each other out, and um, she has her strengths, I have mine. During games, she can come in with her movement, and then I can come in with something completely different. When they get on the mound, it's business. They have that competitor mindset. 
and they just want to get the job done. See the numbers on both Tatum and Taylor. Tatum, the only Big Ten pitcher with an ERA below two and a quarter in conference play. Taylor caught all 17 games that Tatum threw this year.